Hello. Welcome to OnlineEnglishTeacher.com. I'm your instructor. My name is Teacher Michael. Nice to meet you. Uh, so today's lesson is going to be about uh, vowel punctuation. I had a request from a student who wanted to practice punctuation, right? And I think vowels are the should be like the beginner's level to punctuation. So let's get into it right away. But before we get into the video, uh, I would recommend for you guys to like and subscribe to the channel, please. It really helps with the algorithm. It also helps with growing the channel as well, right? So what is a vowel? A vowel are produced by releasing air from the lungs through the oral, right? Through your mouth, oral, or the nasal cavity, right? Or through your nose, right? Or through your throat, yeah? And we typically modify these sounds with our vocal cords, mouth, lips, right? Our lips and mouth to produce distinct vowel sounds. This modification, which it means to change, usually involves adding a form of uh, vibrating motion to it. Vowels are spoken in a uh, spoken language when vowels can be used represented by the letters A, E, oh, I think, or I, yeah, A, E, I, yes. Okay, so there's two types of vowel sounds. There's short and long, and these are very important for you to know in order for you to uh, punctuate these sounds when you're speaking, right? So the most common sound we use for vowels is the short form. So it's the most common. That means we use it a lot. Short A sound is pronounced as cat, right? Apple, mat. So we have a ah sound, right? It's kind of an opening sound. Apple, cat, right? Mat. This is just for exaggeration. That means to... Uh, show emphasis on what I'm trying to do. So short E is pronounced as bed. So we got an E sound. E, right? Bed, pen, elephant, right? So it's an E sound, right? Short I is pronounced like pin, right? With a smile, pin pin, sit, inspect, right? We got an in sound, right? We got a smile in, right? We got a, e, e, and then now we have o. O is pronounced as hot, pot, boss, right? Pretend you're making an o sound, right? when you use a short O, hot, pot, boss. And then we got the short U sound as pronounced, run, sun, fun, truck. So it's kind of like the E, but a A uh, kind of mixed together. So fun, sun, run, truck, right? We got cat, right? A, ah. apple, mat, bed, so e, eh. bed, pen, elephant, right? Pin, pin, lip, sit, inspect, o, oh. hot, Hot, boss, right? Then we have the U again. So, U, run, sun, fun, truck, right? Making this mouth motion. So let's get into the long vowel sounds. The long vowel sounds, they are called long because they're hold, they're being held or hold for a much longer period than the short vowel sounds. 
It's a very different sound, right? Often a word with a short vowel is transformed into a long vowel by placing a silent E at the end of the word, right? I'll explain this in another video. But we have a long A sound is pronounced as eight. Eight, almost kind of like with, with the pen, right? The short E sound, but we have, we do with the A sound, A. This is a little bit more wider, A, right? Not pin, pin is more with the smiling. Eight is more with smiling and opening. Ape, take, right? So we have an A sound. A, like you're saying, hey, right? Long E is pronounced with eat. Kind of the same pro same situation with the uh, the short E, but a little bit longer. Eat, right? Instead of pen, right? Pen, you're going eat, eat, right? It's also a smile, a little bit open. Eat, meet, treat, right? Sleep. And then we have the long I, it just pronounces might, right, blind, kind, kite. So it's kind of an opening, right? On a bit of a smile as well, kite, right? Kite. Then we have the long O sound, which is pronounced as hope. O, instead of hot, right? Hot, that's a short, right? This is hope, right? You're closing in your lips, right? You're closing your lips a little bit more. O, go O, hope, goat, road, boat, right? You're making a much more shorter and closed O sound. Uh, U is pronounced as mute, kind of the same thing as the O sound, but we got OO, making an OO sound, mute, cute, rule. So we have hope, mute, hope, mute, right? With the U sound or OO sound, you're almost coming out with the ooh, ooh, kissing, almost a kissing uh, action, right? So cute, mute, right? Rule, very good. Okay, so this is just saying the same thing as before. The letter A for A sounds as a both short sound, right? Like apple, remember say ah, apple. And the long sound, ape. So it's a, a. Short, a. Long, a. Right? Short, a. Long, a. It can be also, we can also use this for short o, right? Usually followed by the u. A, oh, this is just an example, auto. Then we have the short e. Has a both long, right? Like hello, hello. So when using uh, the short e, I forgot to mention this. Sometimes you have to use your tongue. Hello, hello, l l, right? The tongue is going up. Hell, l l, right? As the tongue right here is going up. Hello, with a long ear, no tongue. There is no tongue. The tongue is not in use. So we use ear, ear, right? The smile again, ear. We've got to make an E sound. Once E, hello, ear, E, double E, he, ear, hear, right? Fear. Okay, I. We can use a short version as an in. We got an e, e, 
for short I. For long is E, like also W sound, E rate, E rate. Very good. Then we got O, O, like hot, right? For the short sound would be ah, ah. For long, O, O, O. Short, octopus. For long, or range. So once ah, that comes like an A, H sound, ah, octopus. Long, O sound, or, or range, or, O. U, U has a short form as well, like uh, ah, uh, right? We said fun, un, uh. So it's kind of a going back, right? We're going back, fun, run, under. And then we have the long U sound, ukulele. So this is going a little bit forward, ukulele. Uh, what was another example? Let me go back. Oh, mute, mute, mute. So one's going forward and one's going back. The short, back. Long, forward, right? And then here's some breakdowns of what the vowels are. You don't have to pay attention to this one right here in the video. Uh, so we still have the long vowel sounds, the short vowel sounds, right? A long, a cake. Remember, we got the a sound. Short, we got the a ah sound, cat. Long e, keep, keep. Double, almost like a double e, go e. Eh, bed, short E, bed, long I, bike, bike. It's like an I, right? We're going a little bit up, I, right? And then short I, sit, right? Sit, just smile, sit. Long O, home, home, remember? Forward, forward, short O. Top, top, top. Very normal. No, no forward, no back. No forward, no back. Very normal. Top, top. All right. And then we have cute. Remember for you, long you. Ooh, ooh, cute, cute. And then for short you, sun. Sun, 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 back. Cute, forward, okay? So if you guys want more lessons on these, remember to leave a comment down below. I'll get back to you guys as soon as possible. But something else I wanna say, also an announcement, I will try to be making videos at least three times a week. I wanna make videos on Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays. And uh, two times out of those uh, videos I'll be making, we'll be focusing on grammar, uh, conversation, owls, exams, uh, writing, right? But on Friday, I'll be doing something a little bit different because I want you guys to learn uh, English on a much more uh, communicative level. So I want you guys to be able to communicate and understand as if you were living in America, right? Because that's very, very important for some people who are taking the IELTS test. They would like to go to an English speaking country. And I would want to prepare you to be able to understand and communicate with the environment around you, right? So I look forward to seeing to you guys, seeing you guys in the future. Right? Remember to please like and comment and subscribe below. And I'll see you guys another day. Take care.